when Willie and I were teenagers, we had a little, we used to save all our money because since we're out in the country, right? going to town and eating at a restaurant was like, ooh. <laughs> Which we never did growing up. And so we would always Until do the older. value right. deals, you know, buy 10 tacos for, you know, $4 or whatever. So it, but back then it was about how much you could eat <laughs> for as little money as possible. <laughs> Jason right. and Willie, Dad would pull their money so they'd have like eleven dollars and twenty cents, and they'd pull in at the drive-through. I was with them one time. I watched it, how they did it. So it was like, so they would order, and they'd say, "How much is that?" Because now it's on the screen, but in the old days, the person had to tell you. And they were like, "Uh, that's eight dollars and thirty cents." Okay, all right. So then the, we're gonna get. All right, what if we have four more tacos and this? How much is that? Well, that's ten fifty. So she still had about four. One of us would be counting all the coins <laughs> down so, to the exact penny. So it's like, what can we get for 45 cents? Well, you can get a, a chalupa <laughs> or a cinnamon stick. All right, we'll take that. So it was like it spent right up to every cent they had. Whatever you had, you spend it all. And you'd always, then you'd say, okay, no soft drink. We'll make that a water. Because back then they'd give that to you free. That's right. Yeah. And you're yeah. like, you don't want to be wasting money. <laughs> you know, just drink. drink water. Now, is that water coming out of the sink? Or is there actually some water? Eating out with the rednecks. <laughs> That's why I miss you. She cannot stand it. Every once in a while, I'll be in some situation like you were. And they're just the the everyone is getting restless and they want to stop somewhere and get because I you know, I pack me an ice chest with yep. all what I eat right but they're like they don't want that they just just stop just stop so then when I stop in there I'm like okay she's telling me what she wants and I'm like did y'all brew this tea <laughs> today and they always they're like what kind of question is that why does that <laughs> hang on let me check you should know this you should know. Off the top of your head, whether that tea that you have in well, that first container. first you got to ask, is it brewed tea? Because now well, they make this instant stuff that well, just, exactly. you can't, it's, you, it's not fit for drinking. But some of these people who are working there, they don't even know the concept. I'll, yeah. I'll say, do you brew your tea? And they're like, let me check. You got to, I'm like, baby, let's get out of here. Right. If you have to check on whether the <laughs> tea was brewed, the test. You all, you've been working there how long? <laughs> of course, what's funny is one time I said, how long have you been working there? And the guy's like, this is my first day. And Missy rolled her eyes. She thought, now, Jace. <laughs> I was like, let's you get just. get one of these customers, you know. That... I said, here's what I'm looking for. All I want to know is, is the, did, is the tea brewed? Was it brewed today? That's all I need to know. Just answer those two questions because cause Missy's like, well, go ahead and give the rest of the order. I'm like, no, if those two, either one of those answers are no, we're not, we're not eating here. <laughs> That's what I was trying to explain to her. She's like, why are you making that? Why are you having this conversation? I'm like, because this is a deal breaker. 